Breaking news 14 days ultimator to release Mazi Namdi Kano today being the seventh day of May 2023. Let the counting down begins. As program agitators give federal government 14 days ultimator to release Namdi Kano, withdraw troops. Let's go. The leader of the Biafra National League, BNN Prince Wee, Shimeze Richard, has given the federal government of Nigeria 14 days to release Namni Kanu. The group threatened to shut down oil explosion in the Nigeria Stokemeru maritime borders. It has also given the same ultimatum to the Nigeria government to withdraw military troops from the southeast region. At a press briefing in Calabar, they also call on Cameroon authority to desist from forcing and collecting proliferated taxes from Nigeria living in the Bakasi Peninsula. Richard said, we want to use this medium to reiterate our decision to shut down maritime borders if our demands are not met within 14 days, effectively from 8 May. 2022. He claimed that BNN was enjoying support from other groups. We are capable of doing anything. We cannot disclose the extent of our capacity. You should know that we command massive loyalists and followers, even amongst the natives. It will be disastrous if our demands are not meant. He called on President Mohamed Bari to release Kano before he hands over on May 29, 2023 and stop being recalcitrated by not obeying court order. We are disappointed and have lost confidence in Buhari government. I cannot say I have confidence in Bua, uh, Bola Ahmed Tinibu who would be replacing Buhari. I don't even know him. Even if Kano is released, it will not stop our agitation for Biafra sovereign, sovereignty. We are demanding for safety and freedom from Nigeria. We have never believed in Nigeria. BIA is not alone in this struggle. There will be no negotiation about Biafra. The group said Nigeria authorities should not force them to take loss into their hands. Um, this action coming from BAA Briswee is a very remarkable one and we need more of this. And after the deadline, let the action begins. And I hope Oyendo will be released before, in fact, before that 14 days, because the next coming court date, we are hoping for the release of Mazin Namde Kano. And meanwhile, for those that don't know, the Prime Minister already declared on the 8th, 9th, 10th, 11 and sit at home also for the release of Mazi Namdekano. Joining with this BN uh, 14 days ultimate starting from the same on the 8th uh, is a very remarkable uh, achievement. That's why I say it was so ever you are, I don't want to know you are in this struggle, whatever you can bring to the table for the demands of the release of Mazi Namdekano for me is highly welcome. And even the loyal to Mazina, they can also reacted to the swing of Jagaban also. I got to Mazina, the can lawyer, a lawyer, you know, say, May 29 is unconstitutional to swear in Jagaban. Nam the Kano's lawyer now react to this particular swing. The special counsel of Nam the Kano alleged Jumako has raised a constitutional issue ahead of the May 29 inauguration of the president elect Bola Tinibu. And Jumako said it's unconstitutional to swear in the winner of an election whose victory has not been affirmed by the court. He pointed out that the winner of an election can be swear in when the election result were uncontested. In a chat with Daily Post, Ejemako stressed that no law in Nigeria permits the swearing in of a winner when the election result is being contested in court. He wrote, given that the finality of the election result is decided by the court, except where the INEC declared result is uncontested, it is unconstitutional to swear in a winner whose victory has not been affirmed by the court. Where is the law that says such a winner must not be swear in? None. Nigeria is just working from opposite <laughs> direction. <laughs> that I will be saying for uh, Libya. I come to say, but my master will be say 
and you work for the one right, the right from this side, they come. I mean, they write like this, they go, because which kind of life be this? So that's how Nigeria they work. Because if you see all those Arab people, they only write, they will write from the edge of the book to this side, but full one line, who they write like this. But Nigeria Constitution, they, they write from the ending. They come <laughs> the beginning. One of our live video comments, subscribe share to all social media platforms. First time when you come across our channel, do awesome subscribe for you. Jump out of this video. All of my people.